Welcome to Let's Play The Sims 4. Okay, so this is a fresh save file. I mean, this thing is pristine. And will I be keeping the save file? Fuck no. But for tonight's stream, there is a family I have selected and we are going to play with them until the stream ends for like the next hour. And I'm going to try to give this bitch a better life or a worse life, one or the other. So the pancake, so when you get a fresh save file, like if you want to play Sims 4 today for free, you can get this. What we're looking at right now, this is free. So this is like the basic world that comes with it. So this is what the pancakes, a lot of people know about the pancakes, but this is what it says. It says, poor, poor Bob and Eliza, They or have they ever been happy? It seems there's nothing one can do to please the other. Just what is keeping this couple together? Or conversely, what is the spark that will finally drive them apart? They said, what is the spark that will finally drive them apart? And I heard my name. I heard somebody calling me, ring, ring, it's Pixie. What is the spark that will finally drive them apart? It might be me. It might be me. So I'm gonna play as Eliza Pancakes today. And will we ever play with this family again? No, this is gonna be a one and done stream. So I'm gonna try to make it count. So this is them. This is Bob. He's giving has a chode energy. And Eliza just needs a better bra and a better haircut. And I think we could, okay, her little snooty ass walk. I'm not sure how I feel about that, to be completely honest. Um, Eliza will soon have her period. But girl, you didn't have to tell me that. You did not have to tell me that. Um, is this Sydney's game? No, this is a fresh save. This I've clicked new save for the, oh, they're watching TV together. Well, you have fun with that, Bob. We're going to the club um, or somewhere. First, we have to give her a makeover because no way am I taking this bitch out like that. Um, okay, so upstairs, the downstairs of their house is fine. They got a lot of chairs for them, two people. And then upstairs, it looks like they have separate bedrooms. I don't think this is a guest room. I think that is a, I think that's a separate bedrooms they have going on. And then what are their traits? Let me see. Bob is, oh, fuck this. He said he's gloomy, a loner, a slob, and has the essence of flavor. Oh, no. Oh, poor Eliza's over here dizzy from, from her period. Girl, she is neat, materialistic, a perfectionist, and business savvy. They literally have opposite traits. Girl, goodbye with that. I'm not dealing with that today. Next thing's next. We're gonna give her a little mini makeover. Why even get married if that's who you are? Literally. Thank you, Scarlett. Thank you, Megs. Thank you, Kendrick. Um, we can do something with this. Am I going to take this whole time to give her a huge makeover? No. But yeah, let's give it some va-va-voom. <laughs> and then take them things off. And then um, let's put a little makeup on you, honey. Yeah, make it dark. Make it sexy. Yes, that beautiful she's looking fantastic already uh that looks heinous um okay yeah that's good that's good let's get some yes okay it's coming along i think it's uh really coming along now we need a different Ooh, i bet spark plug would let you borrow her shirt i bet she would first off bob is not letting her out the house like that let's make her respectable now um, and I'll even put her in base game clothing. You know what? Fuck it. Actually, I like this base game shirt better for going out. Hold on. Yes. Hold on. I don't know if black is her color. You know what? Black is her color today. Black is her color today. I just said I was going to keep it base game. Uh, okay, I'll try to keep it base game. Let's see. Um, content. No. Packs, just base game. This is base game and custom content, apparently, but that's fine. Um, I guess these jeans are what... Actually, no, this little skirt. This little skirt is cute. Mm, the base game is making me itch. Okay, it's fine. That's fine. And then... 
I guess, uh, let me click base game again so I can see packs, base game. Um, oh, these aren't that bad. You know what? We can go out like this. Her hair isn't base game. Oh, but I love, fuck. Okay, fine. Fine. We'll do base game, but I'm not changing her makeup. That is where I draw the line. That is where I draw the fucking line. Um, some of these are custom content, not base game. Oh, at mm -mm. Mm -mm. you should just leave the hair. I agree. I agree. We should just, yeah, yeah, yeah. We're just gonna leave it just like that. Um, and then a little necklace. I don't know which ones are base game. I guess let me click base game. Base game except her face. Yeah, I mean, this is fine. I don't know. We'll do like a little. Yeah, this is fine. This is fine. Um, yeah, Eliza, something about that ring. We're taking it off. Just while we go out. Just while we go out for a little bit. Let's go. Gives PTA class after dark. Thank you, Chloe. Thank you, Brain Dad. Thank you, Candy, for the You're Sweet. Let's see if he even notices. You got shit to say, Bob? She's like, Bob, you have anything to say about me? Of course he doesn't have shit to say. He's just still talking about his TV show or whatever, but it's fine. We're going out. We'll see you later, Bob. Have fun at the house being a slob. We'll clean up after your mess later. Thank you, Moni. Um, so in this town, there is the Blue Velvet Nightclub. And then the other base game pack is Oasis Springs, which has the Rattlesnake Juice Bar. Should we do the Rattlesnake Juice Bar or should we do the Blue Velvet? Mm. Why is she leaving? Because we're going out. Blue Velvet, Rattlesnake, Rattlesnake, Blue Velvet. Oh my god, we're... Uh... Okay, a lot of people are saying Rattlesnake, so we'll do that. We'll see how it is. Mm -mm -mm. Bob, you're not coming with. We're going out. Thank you, Tris. Thank you, Lauren. I'm trying to not think about the fact that my face is on the screen. Because it's going to make me insecure. Okay. We're here at the Rattlesnake. It's 9.20 in the morning. <sighs> you know what they say. It's 5 o'clock somewhere, and I guess we're about to have a long day. The bartender hasn't even showed up for work yet. Fuck. This might be a, this might be an interesting, um, hour. Okay, nobody is here except this, this man sitting on the couch. Uh, oh, she feels flirty! She said, but, but, oh, she's super attracted to Victor. Well, fuck it, do a flirty invitation. We're out, we're about. Eliza! This bitch has been waiting to be unleashed this whole time. She has been waiting for this. He's like, hello. Hello. Look deeply into his eyes. Fuck it. Oh, and he's feeling us. Wow, this is too easy. Oh, oh my god. I thought Nancy Landgrab was getting hit by a car in the background. I was really concerned for a second. Also, this is what um, Oasis Springs looks like. It's not bad, considering it's free. I mean, this world is not that bad. Could be worse. I like the um the alien poster. Cute. Don't bust your ass, Miss Lady. Miss Blue Shirt Lady. Good lord. Okay. Oh, my back. Um, so now this other lady has shown up. Hillary Laurent. Hello. Thank you, April, for the game controller. Damn, and Victor has a whole dang family too. She's cooled it off now that uh other people are in here. She's not being so flirty anymore. Yeah, Victor, you better act right. You got a whole family at home. I mean, we have a whole husband at home, but still. I'm about to change the time because I want it to be a little bit more bumping in here. So let's do six o'clock. Because where the fuck is the... Go make yourself a drink since nobody's here to make it for you. Might as well. It was Lightning McQueen coming through. Mixing drinks stinks. Eliza has... Oh, no. What just happened to this light? Ah! Oh, no! 
Oh. Somebody's got to- Oh my god, he's taking out everybody! Y'all, we might need to get the fuck out of here. The Grim Reaper's just having to take people left and right because he- He's already dead! <gasps> Victor? Oh my god, Bajorn! Not Bajorn is here! Okay, he left. He left. Um... Rest in peace to Douglas Potts, Bernice Robles, and Alec Rodriguez. Um... All right, well, let's make our drink. Mm -mm -mm. Thank you, your car parts. Uh, that was a bit, huh? Got my heart pitcher pattering a little bit <laughs> early. In Can you make your drink? Don't be all, she's a little, she's like, well, you weren't paying attention to me. Do I need to reset you? I will, I will. Mm -mm -mm. We're going to make our drink, make our favorite drink. Make it. Oh my God, this bitch refuses to do it. You know what, whatever. Come over here. And this one's over here drinking something. Who made you that? Go introduce yourself to Bajorn. I remember when Shrekira was all over Bajorn. Why is she not moving? Do I need, do we need to go somewhere else? Is it because everyone here is panicking? You know, I'm not dealing with this. We're going to the Blue Velvet. This side of town is not safe for us. Not safe for us at all. To the Blue Velvet we go. The nightclub. This one's in her town, so she better be kind of careful who she talks to. Bajorn will def get her pre-gamed. This is going to be the sparkles going to die. Welcome to the Blue Velvet. Eliza, what the fuck you got on? What the heck? Why'd you put your hiking boots on with that little... And she's walking in like, and what about head high? She looks like when the toddlers get themselves dressed for school. Oh my god, she's proud of that shit. Where are the bartenders in this town? She's incognito. Detective Eliza on the case. She's waiting for somebody to come serve her too. I might have to hit up the other the other bars that aren't um, base game because let me tell you what, I ain't never not had a bartender at two places back to back. Ever. Girl, you might have to make your own drink again. Go make your favorite drink. Get up. Oh, I, I, I clicked out of it, fuck. Go make your favorite drink. Thank you, Unicorn Farts. Thank you, April. Thank you, Ashley. We don't have the Black Pearl. This is a fresh save. This is a fresh save. So anything that happens in this save did not happen in the Shrekiverse. Uh, nobody better take our damn drink. Ooh. Mm. Why does he look like the type of guy that she would have an affair with? Ugh. I hate that for her. Who is that? Jeffrey Landgrab. Well, you know he's got money. You know that he's got- Ooh. Go do a friendly introduction, Eliza. Thank you, Candy, for all the game controllers. Um, there's a paparazzi here. Of course- Oh, wait, we have the paparazzi here. Thank you, little cinnamon, for the crystal shoe. Aww. And thank you, Rachel, for the forever rosa. Oh my god. Y'all are, like, popping off right now. She's got her wine in hand. Talking to, I'm sorry, Jeffrey Landgrab is so, bitch, please, please. At least she took her drink. She's even got gloves on. No evidence left behind of this. None. Um, he's like really not even talking to us. Like, buy ketamine from him? What else you got? Some halluc- You know what? Fuck it. Let we might as well. We might as well. Actually, no. What about some- No, I don't want that. What about some schmokane? Do you have that? 
some powder. Yeah, you know what? It's only 9.30. It's only 9.30. No! Go away! No! Okay, let's buy. Oh, it's on sale. It was 352 and now it's 281 Mmm. So we're getting it on sale. Girl, buy your shit. He said, show me the money and I'll show you the droogs. The base game is dangerous, y'all. Because No, run away! Yo, run! He's following us. He's showing up everywhere we show up. The Grim Reaper's like, oh my god, I cannot deal with this. Can we, like, do something? You know what? You know what? Eliza, come get this man. Thank you, Chelsea, for subscribing. Eliza, you got this, girl. No! Eliza, don't let him do this. Well, shit. We've got a bad man out here. And she won't even do nothing about it. She won't even do shit about it. Eliza, we have to do something. She's scared. She's scared. Girl. Plot twist, that's really Bob. Bob is not that fine. He's just not. Girl, I hope- Oh, she's coming. She's coming. Eliza, I have faith in you, bitch. I do. I have faith in you. Please don't kill us. Please don't kill us. We can't leave while Sim is dying. Shit, we gotta hide. Girl, you need to scrub this blood off of you. We got. Don't panic. It's okay. It's okay. It's only your first schmurder. You gotta scrub the blood off. You gotta. I le I've learned this from Granny Wolf. You gotta get that shit off of you right now. Ugh. Put the knife away. Okay. Ugh. Um. Um. Not the paparazzi in here with us. Don't take a picture of me. Thank you, Morgan, for resubscribing. Also, thank you guys who have been subscribing to the Patreon. Um, I just hit 300 people on Patreon, and I just feel so thankful. And I'm so excited to keep making stuff on there because it's so fucking fun. And, uh, yeah, so thank you. So I can keep making content like this. Um, I don't think anybody called the police. Oh, yes, they did. This is not good. Can we leave yet? We still can't leave because the Sim is still dying. But <gasps> what is happening? Please let us leave. Please let me leave. Let me see if it'll let me leave yet. Please. You cannot do this while Sim is dying. Okay, let's just go ice skating at the ice skating rink in the middle of the grass. Just go ice skating. Thank you, Brandon. The Grim's looking at him like, and now I gotta do him. He's like, I wonder who did this one. I wonder who did this one. We're gonna go ice skating outside this is supposed to be eliza oh my god look at the boat actually moving oh that's so cute i didn't realize i was in the base game world wow wow but this is eliza's big night out this is her time to shine we're roller skating to burn off the steam from killing a killer Ooh, akira's here akira my guy! That is so cute! Um... 
Um, I feel like I'm watching GTA. <laughs> okay, hold on. I want to- Oh, no, no, no. Don't fall. Oh, we can't even talk to him, I guess, because he's skating. He's on his twirly shit. He's training for the Olympics, bitch. Can we travel yet? Because I don't think I want to be here no more. Oh, we can. Ooh, okay. I was gonna try to keep a base game for y'all, but it's proving to be a bit difficult considering the base game is really beating my ass right now. Um, let's go to the solar flare. It's a lounge. It should be more chill over here. And hopefully we can um, maybe find some friends or something. Mm, had a burp. Oh, we gotta do our schmokane too. Thank you, Morgan, for subscribing for month two. Oh, her needs are bad. Ugh, we should probably find you a potty real quick. Okay, go in the bathroom. We can pee and do our schmokane. This will be excellent. She feels confident, happy about her schmurder. Mm -mm. Okay, now we're in here. Where's our shit we bought? Okay, let's open our bag and then uh, we'll put it on the bathroom counter and then, yeah, go ahead and do some of that. You're going to need it for, it's, yeah, we're going to need it. Okay. Mm -mm -mm. Where are the bartenders? It's mad weird. That's what I'm saying. Where the fuck are the bartenders? Eliza, that was kind of weak how you did that, but I'm gonna let it go. Um, does everybody know we're a killer? Because they're looking at me crazy right now. I hope not. We might have to... Where are the bartenders? Where are the bartenders? Weird. Very weird. Ooh, Mortimer Goth. Let's go do a friendly introduction with him. Oh, wait. Oh, I clicked off of it. <gasps> oh, he left. He said, ain't no way, Jose. And it's about to be the morning time here soon. Okay, so let's go back home to dumbass Bob. We're not going to tell him anything about our schmurdering. And we're not going to tell him anything about our schmokaning either. We're just going to go back home. We're going to get into our... And he won't even know that we came home late because we have separate bedrooms. It's fine. Mm -mm -mm. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Do not go on the sidewalk. My son was arrested and sent to prison for doing schmucks in a bar. <gasps> mm. well, that's not good. He's still sitting on that damn couch watching that fucking, you know what, it's fine. We're going to go back upstairs. We're going to take a little, we're going to take a bubble bath after that experience. Okay. It was just a rough first night out. In the morning, we're going to go to Windenburg, which is not base game, but you know what? Forgive me. You know what? This isn't a base... I mean, we're not even really playing base game. We're just playing with a base game family. But thank God. There goes her hair again. So we're going to take this bubble bath. We're going to go to sleep. And then in the morning, we're going to travel over to Windenburg, where we're going to go to the coffee shop, where we're going to meet someone tall, dark, and handsome. And then she's going to feel convinced to leave Bob. I just feel it. <sighs> I don't think he knew you left, babe. Ugh! Ugh. It's fine. Everything is fine. She is cramping from being on her period. This is bad timing for me to come visit her in her world. But you know what? It's fine. I love how you can see the, the shadow on the window. It's actually kind of like creepy almost that you see the shadow like moving with the trees. Mm. Will this be on YouTube? Hell yeah. Um, Girl, you're taking a very long bath. It's almost 4 o'clock in the morning. I want to be up at 7 to go to that cafe. Thank you. Get in the bed. Go sleep. She, oh no, she's starting to come down from her, her shmai, too. Uh, did you lock your doors? No. Do we need to lock it? Lock it for everyone but the household members. I swear to God, if our house gets broken into too, I, I might have to get out of the save file. It's starting to feel a little creepy. And also, why does he got that workout equipment in his room? I do not think he's working out. He has been sitting on that fucking couch this entire time. This entire time. Um, 
What did Ashley say? What did Ashley say? I missed it. I missed it. She gave Jason his red wings. Oh, no! Oh, no! Okay, we're sleeping. She put the glasses back on to sleep. Okay. Bizarre. Um, Bob 100% is not working out. He could work on himself like Shrekunzel did. He could. I doubt he's gonna, though. I doubt he is going to. Okay, it's 5.41. I'm gonna let her sleep for another hour, and then we're gonna get up and go to the cafe in Windenburg. Oh, now Bob heads off to- he's gotta take a shit, and then at 6 o'clock in the morning, he's gonna go to bed. Interesting. Oh, no, no, no. 6 o'clock in the morning, that is when he starts playing games on his computer. I don't know when bedtime is for him, but alright. I'm not worried about Bob today. Yeah, you're here. TikTok didn't tell me you were alive. Oh, no. Luckily, you're not missing any of the storylines you already know. We're just playing with Eliza Pancakes today. I will say, I think like five or six people have died. But you know what? It's fine. Moving on. We're only halfway through. Um, Even though we're not supposed to be... Nobody's supposed to be dying. So, anyways, let's go to the cafe in Windenburg. Um... Windenburg. This is my favorite world. Not because it's the prettiest. I just like how many lots there are. And I really like the little town. And then I really like this little island over here. This is what it looks like when it's untouched. So like in my Shrek save file, you know that this is all crazy. Over here is far, far away. And there's other shit everywhere. Um, but let's go. There's two coffee shops. There's Hare and Hedgehog. And there's South Square Coffee. I want to go to South Square Coffee, I think. Windenburg is based on Germany. That slays. Um, let's go. Oh, not Bob Pancakes. He is not coming with us. We're just going alone. It's been 35 minutes. I feel like so much has happened, but we have done nothing. Done nothing? We've done so much. We did Schmokane. We murdered the murderer. and then Or murdered the Schmurder. And then, um, oh, it's snowing. Thank you, Kayla, for the five fires. Why is nobody working in this save file? There's already a barista hired on this lot. Where? Where are these employees at, bitch? Because I'm about to go to this cupcake stand over here instead. Uh, let's go order a drink. Yeah, let's go order an iced coffee from her because shit. It says Elijah, uh, Elijah. Eliza should start thinking about further education. Take a look at our options by researching universities below. Go to go to university. We don't have time for that today, but interesting. Um, are there Sims in the base game? Yeah, there are. This is one of them. <laughs> We're looking at her right now. I didn't make her. I don't like how that bitch with bunny ears is looking at us. I don't like this at all. Girl, I'm watching you. I am watching you. Uh uh, don't cut me! She literally just tried cutting us in life. Ooh, tall, dark, and handsome. Hold on. Go do a friendly introduction with him. Eliza, run, bitch. Don't be stupid. Don't be stu Go. Go. <laughs> she looks like she's about to take us to Wonderland. Mm. I like your earrings. Uh, Marcus Flex. Okay, flirt with him. And then give him a heartfelt compliment. Oh, he's feeling us. He's feeling us. Thank you, Veronica Sparrow, for subscribing. Um, yeah, we'll compliment his appearance because, you know, let's see... It says they, she perceives him as very attractive, but they have bad compatibility. Mm. Oh, did she just dump her drink on him? And he's just dropping 50 right here. I don't know if that's a praise king thing or what, but I don't like how he just dropped it right there. There's also nobody in the, I don't know where all the server, like what? The hell? Are they on strike today? Okay, let's go to the other one now. They don't have to be compatible for long. 
We're gonna go to the hare and the hedgehog now. See what's going on over there. They're afraid of her. <laughs> Uh, well, she's used to bad compatibility. Yeah, that might be her type now. Toxic might just be her fucking type now. Mm -mm -mm. Thank you, Candy, for Henry the Hedgehog. Once again, nobody's here. What in the fuck? Very bizarre. But you know what? Go make your own drink, I guess. Go do a perfect pre-work shot. Sure, do that. It's snowing over here too. Once again, super pretty. Um, not as pretty as some of the other worlds, I will say. Thank you, Unicorn Farts, for the live fest clappers. Thank you, Ashley, for the donut. Thank you, Mermaid, for the snowman. What world is that? It's um Windenburg. Oh, look how cute that little shot is. That's so adorable. Well, maybe we can make friends with this lady because we've seen her around. Miss Hillary, she's a little stressed out. Let's try <gasps> Mortimer. Hold on, I just saw him. Yes, Mortimer Goth. Let's go do a friendly introduction to Mortimer. And now, since we schmurdered the schmurderer, we shouldn't have problems with him showing up, right? Right? Do you have the stories and MC thing for not empty venues? Um, I don't know. I do not know. Let's see if she's attracted to him. She perceives him as very attractive. Slay. Let's support his facial hair. Let's give him a pep talk, because I guess, sure. Let's gossip. Um, let's, uh, oh no, he, is he getting upset? I don't know. Uh, do a hip bump. And then, um, don't reminisce about your wedding day. Do not do that. We're gonna, uh, flirt with him. See if he's feeling us. Do a couple of flirt. Okay. And Mr. Jang is calling us. Talking about, I hear there's someone famous over at the lounge. Want to go check it out? No, I hate the famous Sims, actually. Ooh, he is feeling us. So, let's, um ask him a risque question and then hold hands does she find bob attractive she finds him extremely attractive which is interesting let's do a sexy pose and then we'll embrace and then um do a steamy kiss fuck it we have nothing to lose. Oh, not outside the coffee shop in the next town over. <gasps> Eliza, you dirty girl. Okay, let's whisper to him seductively because now you know he wants to get in our pants. He doesn't give a fuck about kissing. He's a man. He's worried about where is his peen gonna go. Um, let's blow him a kiss. Um... Let's, uh, let's make a, you know what, fuck it, make a move on. Oh, she's kissing his neck. I did not tell her to do that, but you know what, fuck it. Whatever. Y'all better find somewhere private if y'all are gonna do that, though. Because right now y'all are pretty secluded, but he's married to Bella and she's married to Bob. Oh, they're going upstairs in the coffee place. They're going upstairs in the coffee place. To where? Please tell me I got the blur. Okay, the blur is on. Woo! Right there? Right there in the hallway? From the back? They're just a blur. They're just a blur. Oh my god. We don't let her. We unleashed her, y'all. We unleashed her, okay? A snap the wall bang. <laughs> he don't give a fuck. No, he does not. Is this, this is censored enough, right? Right. I mean, it's just censored. Okay. Um, who's this? I don't know who that person is. They better hope nobody has to go potty up here. 
But everybody seems to just be chilling downstairs in the cafe. No drinks, because we don't have a fucking bartender for whatever reason. Or coffee tender. Um, It must have been a long time for her to do it in the hall. No, really. No, literally. These guys are talking outside about what? Beds. What are you talking about beds with him for? Are you trying to get in his bed? He said, got to go. Car. Zoom. Poetry. Slam poetry. Oh, she's still against the stair wall thing. Oh, he, I could tell through the blur he was grabbing her neck. Mm, maybe there's a strike going on. Barista, bartender, or uh, coffee tender, whatever. Bean tender. Bean tender. That sounds kind of a little. Anyways. Um, Mr. Jang is calling us again. Hey, Eliza, I'm in town for a while, and I was wondering if I could stay at your place for a few days. It'll be fun. Mr. Jang, you are not staying at my house. The fuck? The fuck? Um, is Wicked Whims ever animated? Uh, yeah, when you have the blur taken off. Yeah, oh my god. Oh my god. Is she taking her time with it? Lord... What does it say? The the animation is called Pussy Frontage. Oh my lord. Mr. Jang heard what Eliza's been up to. She better be quiet upstairs before somebody comes up there. That'd be awkward as fuck. That would be awkward as fuck. Where's he going to sleep with Bob? <laughs> New band name. <laughs> Downtown at the coffee shop. Oh my goodness. Too good. Too fucking good. Uh. Jang staying at the house is. A I do not want Mr. Jang staying at my house. Absolutely not. Bob's over there. What are they gonna do? Play video games? And now we got the other rich guy down here, Jeffrey Landgrab. I kind of want to do it at his mansion, actually. After she gets done with this, we're going to his mansion. She wants to see a mansion, she wants to smell a mansion. She deserves it. She had to kill a man. She said, oh my good What the? He said, thank you for that. Thank you for that. Okay, bye Mortimer. Bye. She said, let me wash myself up after that. Give yourself a little horse bath or something. Um, oh my God. She did some schmocaine without us. Oh my God. And it says quickie with a hottie. Whoa, not only is Eliza's latest partner a breath. Sorry, my septum piercing is like sideways. Um, well, not only is Eliza's latest partner a breathtakingly beautiful sim, but they also appear to be a sex, I how do you say that word? Leaving Eliza aching for more. Aching for more? And he came back upstairs. He said, you know what? You know what? Listen, Mortimer, we want to go see a mansion. So unless you're going to let us come over to your mansion, I'm kind of scared of Bella Goth. I'm kind of scared uh, of Bella Goth. And I kind of want to see this other mansion. So you know what? Let's go to the the Jeffrey Landgrab mansion. Or actually, let's just try to come downstairs and... Uh, oh, I forgot we got our schmocaine from him. Let's go flirt with him for a minute and see if he'd be down. Thanks for that, Mortimer. Th oh, no. What's happening out here? It zoomed me out, I thought. Or maybe I zoomed myself out. Every time I see a zoom now, I get anxious. Okay, I guess we're fine. I guess we're fine. I don't think that's the barista, because it doesn't say barista. Oh, don't do it from across the room. Now everybody's gonna know. Now everybody is gonna know. Not the bunny girl here, too. Oh my gosh, she's doing it from the room again, and now he just saw that, and now he's mad? Bitch. Now all of China is gonna know that you're cheating on Bob Pancakes. Now all- <sighs> Amateur hour. Amateur hours. That's what this is. Girl, we got- Who the- Oh, it's that girl talking about she wants a date with somebody. Looking for love. Sapphire Hudson. Yeah, I've seen her before. Girl, we're not interested. Thanks, though. We're about to actually get the fuck out of here. I don't know what that guy was mad about at all. At all. Mortimer soaked off. No, he literally did. Literally did. Ugh. Broken hearted Mort. 
Uh, Bob just went to work. I guess he's a cook. I didn't even notice that he had a job. <gasps> His wife just showed up. So that not, um, that's, uh, Jeffrey's wife just showed up. So that means she's not at his house. So let's go to the mansion. And I happen to know where, uh, so in Oasis Springs, they live in this, like, big-ass mansion over here. Yes, so she's over there. He just went home. So we are going to go there. This is perfect. This is too good. Too good. Scandalous. Yo said, hey, hey, hello. <laughs> okay, let's go knock on the door. This is the mansion. It's okay. It's cool or whatever. And she's, uh... Oh my god, Eliza's feeling bad now. She said, she said, they say lightning never strikes the same place twice. Well, tell that to Eliza. She found the sim of her dreams and by some miracle got to marry him too. There are times like this when Eliza likes to remind herself just how lucky they are to be married to a ravishing hunk like Bob Pancakes. To be able to love and be loved by such a captivating creature brings incomprehensible joy to her heart and the attraction they have for their beloved partner still endures like an undying blaze even now. Bitch. Bitch. Not you talking- That was extra as fuck. If you feel bad, just say that. But we're already here. We're already here. Like, go- You know what? Let's, um... Do an embrace. Do an embrace. And now she's craving her spouse. Well, shit, we could- And he's at work now. As soon as he's at work and we're already at this damn mansion, girl. Uh, and you were talking about your marriage is terrible and whatever. Whatever. Is his son there? First of all, fuck his son. I really don't care about Malcolm Landgrab. Um, let talk to him about some of your fantasies that maybe like Bob wouldn't be into. Oh. oh, this piece of shit. Actually, no. Actually, no. Not him scaring us like that. No, absolutely not. Beat his ass for that. Uh, no way he's gonna treat Eliza like that. No way he's gonna treat Eliza like that. Did he block it or something? Hold on. Hold on, because I am... I will do it twice, if I must. If I must. Get him. He's a little upset about that. She did punch him in the face, and now she's feeling a little dizzy from her period. Let me fix that. We didn't even give him a black eye, though. I feel like she needs to do more to him than just that. Let's, um... Yeah, hold him hostage for money. You know what? Fuck it. We're already in this situation. Might as well, because he's going to call the police either way at this point. Oh, I zoomed through it. Maybe he got out of it. I don't know. We got to get the fuck out of here before he calls the police. Mm-mm-mm. Where are we going to go? You know what? Just ask him if he wants to fuck. Just, if he doesn't want to, he doesn't have to. Just see if he'd maybe be down on the couch real quick. He turned her down. Oh, well, where'd she go? Upstairs to the room? Of course she's on that computer. Is his son and... Mmm, peculiar idea. You know what? We might as well go out with a... Ooh, on the rich people patio, too. On the rich people patio, please. Oh my god, we don't have the son as an option, but we do have the wife as an option. We do have the wife as an option. She said hi! Oh my god. The hiccup. She said no. She said no. Girl, why? Oh, she's not into girls. Ugh, lame. Very lame. You know what? You know what we need to do? The sound of disgust. 
I'm sure Nancy's down for everything. She literally said no. Um, I guess let's go back to her fucking house. She needs to chill out. She killed a man. She fucked a man at the coffee shop. <laughs> I think it's been a good day. But let's go back to her house and see if Bob is home from work yet. Um, Mr. Jang, you can come over, I guess, and hang out. Bella definitely goes for the beans. She'll probably take a test. <gasps> I didn't even think about a pregnancy test. Mm. Hey, Mr. Jang. Hey, Bob. Um, you know what? She wants her stinky-ass husband. Oh, he left. Now we just have Mr. Jang here. She doesn't want to woohoo with Mr. Jang. Let's go take a pregnancy test really quick. Oh, she doesn't even have the option to take a pregnancy test, so I guess she's not pregnant. Um, let's go take a little, a little bath, I guess. If she has a name, a baby, name it IHOP. Why is Mr. Jang there? I said he could come over at this point. Thank you, Candy, for the Lucy Lalana. Also, thank you guys for, uh, surpassing the goal for today. Um... Thank you, Kendrick, for the hanging lights. We're getting in the bathtub. She's a little uncomfortable uh, from coming down from doing some schmocaine. Thank you, Rachel. Thank you, Alyssa. Thank you, Unicorn Parts. She's not pregnant. She's not pregnant. He wrapped his Twinkie. Where is he going? Into our other bathroom? I love how they have separate bathrooms. He just had to flush the toilet first. All he did was flush the toilet. Bob didn't flush his shit down the toilet. Check your phone. I well, can't put the quotes in. Oh no. Mm -mm. Mort diddled her fiddle. You know what? Let's call him over here because he was a good time. You know, might as well. Might as well. Let's um invite to hang out at current lot. Girl, get out the bathtub. Get out the bathtub. Where's Mortimer? Where is Mortimer? Did he come? Did I miss it? Oh, he's not him playing chess on the balcony with Mr. Jang. Mortimer, we actually want to do it with you. And we want you to do it to us, to be honest, mostly. Is he going to do it? Are we going to do it? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, they got the pillows messed up already? Not Eliza Pan- Wait, that's Bob's room. That's Bob's room. Wait, he does not wash his his sheets. We're just gonna hope that she washes his sheets for him because we're we're getting our coochie in Bob Pancakes' room. Oh no Is that Bob? Oh oh no oh no He's just gonna watch the TV. He's never gonna know. He's not He's not even gonna make it in the house. He's not even gonna make it in the house. This is a power move. <laughs> okay. Fluff in the bed for Bob. He said, I really gotta get going now. Okay, bye, Mr. Jang. He walks right past us. Mm. Oh my god. You know what? I'm happy for it. I really am. Shout out to Mortimer for making our girl happy. Vlad is texting us and says, Hello there. I just wanted to welcome you to the community. And my, that's a lovely neck you have there. Thanks. Thanks. Jang is about to snitch. I will <laughs> Jang immediately. Immediately. Wake Bob up. I'll wake him up, but we don't know what he's going to do now. He might just go right back to sleep. Bob, you look stank as fuck. Oh, we're being mounted. With your dirty ass in our bed? No, get up from there too, cause ain't no way you're sleeping your dirty ass. Oh, she's still she's still naked right there. And now Bob's in her room. Go tell Bob to get out of your fucking bed. Go wake him up. Go wake him up. She said, get up. Now we're gonna tell him. We're gonna tell him what we been. Yeah, 
you know what? We're separating. We're separating. Tell him that we're loving another. That's what we're gonna do. Oh wait. We're gonna say that we're because we're cheating. Or should we say woohoo life where? Mmm, a mistake. There's a lot of different options. We can say loving another, the this love is dead, can't provide investment, life crisis, a ghost of a partner, cheater. Uh uh. Love me another. Break up with you know what? First we're gonna fuck you and then we're gonna ruin your day. But wake up. First we're gonna woohoo you, and then we're going to absolutely destroy your soul. Because you know what? You fucking suck. He doesn't even want to. He doesn't even want to. Oh wait, yes he does. He looks up look at his face at the thought that he has to woohoo with his wife. Please don't put Bob on Patreon. Bob is not going on Patreon. Mm. Mm. Is this going to be on YouTube? Yes, it is. He looks sad. Yeah, because he's annoying. Okay, well, all right. Now let's break up with him. Wake up, Bob. Wake up. Just as I thought, no fireworks. Okay, we are going to uh, separate angrily and we're gonna say a ghost of a partner. Eliza's partner is too distant. Eliza's ready for a real relationship with someone more attentive and loving. Yeah, tell him he's a ghost of a partner and he doesn't wash his ass and he didn't flush the toilet. Not even blubbering. Oh my god, wipe your tears. Ew, she has cum on her face. Ugh, okay. Bob, it looks like Bob has not been getting along with a particular- He's calling us egotistical? And now he's decided that he just dislikes egotistical sims? We're not egotistical for wanting more for ourselves. Uh-uh. Uh-uh. Whatever. Fuck you, Bob. Literally, come wash yourself off. Come use the bathroom. And... Did we try for a baby? No, we did not. No, we did not. No, we did not. No, we did not. He got his syrup in us. That messy motherfucker, Bob Pancakes, got his goddamn syrup in us, and now we're about to have a little muffin. Fuck. Fuck. All right. Well. Um. In that case. I think I'm going to uh, end this part here. Whose? It's definitely Bob's. She just fucked Bob. Like, we can check. Actually, let's see what it would have been if we... And it's twins. And it's twin girls. It's twin girl babies. And, um... Yeah. Love that. Bob really had the last laugh. Wow. A double stack of pancakes, yes. Precisely, that's what just happened. Um, love that for us, and don't love that for us. Not her being like, honey, I'm gonna make you some food, actually. Um, but thank you guys for watching this part. I hope you enjoyed this uh, one and done type of episode. There won't be more parts to this or anything. Just a little playing with a random townie and seeing what their little pre-made story is and trying to make their life a... Uh, more interesting or better or whatever um this will be on youtube later thank you guys who have been subscribing to the patreon i love you and appreciate you and if you haven't already subscribed you should because we're having uh we're doing lots of um fun stuff on there so yeah 
I will see you guys in my next live. And for those of you wanting to discuss the episode after this, we'll be in the Discord discussing in the after the episode chat. So yeah, I love you. Good night.